today we are making tomato basil soup. This is a very delicious soup, easy to make, healthy, full of flavor. You're gonna love it. Hello and welcome to Cooking Lessons for Dad where you'll learn to cook healthy, cook easy. My name is Karen Breyer, and today we are going to make tomato basil soup. This is a delicious, flavorful soup, easy to make, fresh ingredients. The ingredients in this recipe are olive oil, minced garlic, diced onion, diced carrots, diced celery, water, diced tomatoes, dried basil, fresh Italian parsley, balsamic vinegar, kosher salt, and fresh ground pepper. The first thing that we're gonna do is heat the olive oil over medium low heat in a large saucepan. So we need one to two teaspoons of olive oil. Let's go ahead and heat the pan. So we're just gonna wait for this to heat up a bit feeling pretty hot, we'll go ahead and add one tablespoon of minced garlic. You can mince your fresh garlic or use a prepared garlic like I have. Next, one and a half cups of diced onion. You want a small size of dice. Next, one cup of small diced carrots. Next, one cup of small diced celery. Okay, go ahead and stir the vegetables around, get them kind of covered in the oil. Now make sure the heat's on medium-low, you don't want it too high. Go ahead and cover the pan. We're gonna cook the vegetables about 10 minutes until the vegetables are soft. You wanna stir it occasionally. Make sure the heat's on medium-low. So give it an occasional stir. If the vegetables seem like they're getting dry, you could add a little bit of the water. Okay, it's been about 10 minutes. Turn the heat off. You might wanna let it cool a minute, then we're gonna go ahead and put it in a blender or food processor and blend it till it's smooth. Okay, next we'll add one cup of water. And we're gonna blend the mixture until it's smooth. Go ahead and check it. Looks pretty smooth. So we're gonna go ahead and pour it back into our pan. Okay, next we're gonna add half of our tomatoes. So we have six cups of diced tomatoes. I'm gonna go ahead and add three cups right now. Next, we're gonna add one tablespoon of dried basil. You could use fresh basil, a half a cup, dice it up, put half of it now with these tomatoes, and then the other half you'll put with the other tomatoes. But it works just fine, very delicious with dried basil. Next, one teaspoon of kosher salt. You could use a Another salt if you like, sea salt, other salt. A quarter teaspoon of ground pepper. You could use fresh ground pepper as well. Go ahead and stir the ingredients together. We're gonna go ahead and bring the mixture to a boil. So put it on medium, medium high. While we're waiting for the mixture to come to a boil, I just want to mention, I like to use Roma tomatoes because they have less liquid, less juicy, makes a thicker soup, but you can use regular tomatoes as well. I've made it both ways, delicious both ways, but I kind of like it thicker. Okay, the mixture has come to a boil. Go ahead and reduce the heat to a simmer. Cover the pan. We're gonna simmer the soup for about 15 minutes. You wanna make sure to stir it occasionally. Still at a boil, we'll get it down to a simmer. 
While the soup is simmering, we can go ahead and chop our parsley. I like to take, just use the leaves, but you can use the stems too. You need one half cup. I like to crumple it all up and just chop it. Keep your fingers back. We'll set this aside. We'll be back when our soup is finished simmering. Okay, our soup's been simmering about 15 minutes. You're gonna go ahead and turn the heat to the very lowest or turn it off. And then we're gonna add the rest of our tomatoes. We have three more cups of diced tomatoes. Stir those in. About half a cup of chopped Italian parsley. One tablespoon of balsamic vinegar. Stir the ingredients together. Now you just need to make sure all the ingredients heat all the way through. Once everything is heated through, you can add more salt and pepper to taste and it's ready to serve. It smells so delicious. So let's try some. This is perfect with a sandwich, with bread, crackers, side dish, main dish. You're gonna love it. Okay, ready to try it? it smells so good. Mm. So flavorful, so delicious. You're gonna love it. See you in the next lesson.